I don't know, it just screams fall in my opinion. Flannels are just one of our favorite pieces of clothing during the fall and winter months. And I was like, oh my gosh, it's literally the cutest little white skirt. These things are to die for. Hello you guys, it's Karen. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello there. My name is Karen and I make brand new videos for you guys every single week. So you should definitely be sure to hit that subscribe button down there so that you do not miss out on all of my brand new videos and shorts. All right, so we are officially halfway through October. So I thought that right now would be the perfect time for me to talk all things fall fashion for 2024. I have a bunch of clothes that I pulled out of my closet that I'm gonna be wearing throughout this season. And so I kinda wanna go through each item, tell you guys a little bit more about it, just to kinda give you guys some outfit inspo for the fall season. So basically, I'm calling this video Fall Outfit Ideas, AKA What's in My Closet for Fall 2024. I have dresses, pants, skirts. I kind of have some transition clothes for you guys since in some places it's still really hot outside, but in other areas it's starting to get a little bit colder. So I have all the different types of clothes for you guys. So without further ado, let's just get started with this week's video. So basically I'm just gonna go through and show you guys every individual piece of clothing and then I'll also show you how I piece them together to make cohesive outfits. First up I have this super cute lace white top which is from Altered State. I actually got this top on sale for like five dollars last year and I was so so excited and happy to find it. And then I sometimes pair that white top with my black jean jacket. This one is just from Shein but it's so high quality. I got it for the Guts World Tour earlier this year in March and I've loved it ever since but it hasn't been cold enough outside to wear it. So now that we are transitioning into fall and winter, this is going to be one of my favorite pieces of clothing. I typically pair Pair that top and those pants with my Levi's jeans. I love these things so much and all together it creates this really cute fall look. I don't know it just screams fall in my opinion and I just love how they look together. I think it's so cute. It's also really cozy and it looks like you put a lot of effort into an outfit because like you have the layer with the leather jacket but in reality it's just a really simple look. These are my favorite Levi's. I got these for Black Friday last year for a really good deal. These are the ribcage straight ankle jeans from Levi's and I love them. If you're wanting to get a pair of really high quality Levi's jeans, you might want to wait until Black Friday because that's whenever they typically have their best sales of the year. Next up, I have two pieces that make a really good transition outfit for whenever it's transitioning from really hot temperatures to a little bit colder temperatures because you might not want to wear jeans just yet because it's still really hot outside in certain areas. So first up, I have have this white skirt. This is from Forever 21. I got it maybe like four years ago and I've never worn it until recently because I stumbled upon it in my drawer and I was like oh my gosh it's literally the cutest little white skirt and you can just pair it with anything. So for this outfit I am putting it with this black long sleeve turtleneck which I got from a local boutique also about five years ago for Black Friday. They were doing these for like $15 and I really do like this black turtleneck. I also have paired it with my Levi's jeans so that really goes with well together and then you can also do it with a skirt you can do it with shorts but yeah you can just get some sort of a simple thin turtleneck either in white or black and you can get either a black or white skirt and you can pair them together just so it's not like suffocating you and you're really hot but at the same time you still kind of have some of that fall flare next up is one of my favorite outfits to wear and i kind of hopped on this trend about two winters ago i think it was winter 2022 and then i wore it all of last year and then i'm definitely going to be wearing these again in 2024 to me it's just such a cute trend but I have my favorite flannel here with me. I love flannels. I have this one. I have a darker pink one. And then I think my sister has one as well that we share often. So flannels are just one of our favorite pieces of clothing during the fall and winter months. This one is from the brand She Plus Sky. And it's super high quality, very thick. And it's definitely one of my favorite ones. So I would definitely recommend during fall to start looking for a really cute flannel. I would also really love one in like a royal blue darker colors because mainly the ones that I have are all pink. Yeah, but flannels are just so good because you can wear just a white t-shirt under them And then if it gets hot you can take the flannel off whenever you take it off You can even wrap it around your waist like tie it in a knot and then it adds like a little fashion accessory So flannels are just all things amazing during fall and this one even has little pockets So you can put things in there, but it doesn't have side pockets. It just has these two right here I typically love to pair my flannels with leggings if it's not that cold outside But if it is getting pretty cold and chilly, I will pair it with my leather pants these things 
are so, so cute. I love them so much. I got these about two years ago. They're still like the only pair of like professional looking pants that I own. I got these at a local boutique. These look like pockets in the back, but they're just fake. So that's kind of sad. But yes, definitely you should look into purchasing a flannel for this season. Um, You could even do more of like the rustic orange, dark red, maroon kind of colors for this time because I feel like that matches the vibe of the season better. Not really like my pink one that I just showed you guys. But yeah, flannels are so cute, especially if you're going to do like some sort of fall photo shoot at a pumpkin patch. Maybe you're taking some pictures in the leaves. Flannels are like at the top of my list for things to wear for Instagram photo shoots throughout fall. Next up, I have this fall dress. This I actually bought in summer, which sounds crazy. I wear this during fall a lot because it still has short sleeves and it's just a little sundress looking thing. So it's very light. It's not very heavy. This is from Francesca's. I'm sure they don't sell it anymore. My best friend and I were at the mall and uh, I just tried it on and I was about to leave to go on my graduation trip when I graduated from high school and I thought it was really cute and my best friend kind of like hyped me up to buy it. So that's how I got this dress, but I really love it. It just zips down the back and it kind of has the cuffed sleeves right here with like the smock detailing you could consider getting a sundress right now even though it's fall but if you live in an area where it's super hot all throughout october and throughout the beginning of november you can still wear those dresses but just get one that has like orange in it maybe like some browns or some reds because those colors obviously look better with the fall ambiance outside I'm really excited to wear this next outfit again this year. I kind of have worn it throughout the past three years, but it's really basic. It's just some white cargo pants from Target and then this orange sweater. Where is this from? This is from PacSun. You know how whenever you go to PacSun and they're like, buy one, get two free? That's how I got this sweater. I bought like a red sweater and then some other random thing and then I got this for free or I got two things free. I don't really remember, but I got this orange sweater. I really do like this. It just literally is the embodiment of fall. I love it, but it's really basic. It's just an orange sweater. And and then these Target cargo pants, got these on sale last year and I was like, they won't have my size, but they did. And I literally love them so much. They have like pockets on the side, on both legs, and you can actually like open them up and stick your phone in them. They have back pockets as well. They're really wrinkled because they've been in my drawer for the past six months. And then they're from the brand Universal Thread and they consider them boyfriend jeans. I just call them cargo pants because I like the way that they fit. They're really big and they're not tight or skinny in any sort of way. Yeah, so those are considered boyfriend pants, boyfriend jeans, whatever you want to call them but I really do like them in the color white right now because you can pair them with a rustic colored sweater or shirt and it's a really really cute fall outfit so that is all the like fall outfit pieces that I have to show you guys I'm going to include some b-roll of me wearing them just to show you what the completed outfits look like but now I'm going to show you guys my shoes for the fall season Okay, so I have four pairs of shoes that I just love to wear throughout this season that I want to show you guys. First up, these black leather boots. They make such a statement in my opinion. I wear these typically with my leather pants because they blend really well with the pants so that not much attention is going to your shoe. It just all kind of like blends seamlessly. And yeah, these are my favorite. I got them from a local boutique, I'm pretty sure, called Frock Candy. And I got them for a Black Friday because they were doing like 40% off all shoes. Most of my clothes and shoes are from Black Friday. I keep saying that throughout this video but do love black friday as you guys know next up i have these white boots these things are to die for they kind of give like a rain boot vibe they have the super chunky platform bottom because that's like my favorite i love like the little indentions right here with the platform edge and I normally wear these with my white cargo pants because as I just mentioned, they just blend really well with the pants so that you don't have a bunch of attention being drawn to your feet and it just all goes together. The only thing that I hate about these is that after a while, this part, it does start to like cut into your leg. It gets kind of annoying. So I try to wear like crew socks with these so that I have like more protection because if I don't, then I'll start to like get blisters around that area and it's just a really weird sensation. Thirdly, I have these tan boots. I've never worn these, they're pretty much clean on the bottom I think the only time I wore them was whenever I tried them on and then whenever I like, took them home and tried them on in my house yeah but these are really cute I don't know it's a really nice material so if it's raining outside you definitely do not want to wear these because they will get damaged really easily and I would probably wear these with the flannel outfit would be really cute with these so you can get like some zip up little boots and then lastly I also wore these during summer so these aren't just a fall shoe but I got these from Shein about two months ago maybe a month and a half ago and I love these things. Again, you can tell I love the platform wedge and just the really cool cuts all around them. I got them and my mom was like, they look like the shoes that you wore to high school, but in black. And I laughed, but they really do look like my uniform shoes. They tie right in the center and they have a little pattern 
in the sole. I feel like I could pair these with a lot of things. They just go really well. I couldn't figure out which outfit these shoes would go well with, but I just realized the white skirt and the black turtleneck. I think these would pair perfectly with that. Those are just a little bit uncomfortable, so I don't know how long I could wear those tan boots for. But yeah, those are my favorite fall shoes. Um, I'm so excited to wear those this year. I just wanted to give you guys a few ideas because like you put together the outfits, but then it's like, wait, what about shoes? You kind of forget about that part. So I wanted to show you guys my favorites. I also just realized like as I wrapped up this video, this week's video might be really short. I apologize. It shows, I was trying to think of some fall ideas. This week I had another idea for a video planned and then it didn't end up working out because I went to start planning it and I just couldn't think of anything on how to make it a long video. So then I came up with the fall fashion ideas video. So this is what we're doing this week. It might be a shorter video. I've been having a lot going on right now. So I'm just trying to like get my videos done at the same time, but I'll probably still have longer ones in the future. It's just the topic this week was really limited. So I couldn't make too, too long of a video about it. I apologize for that. So there you have it. Those are my fall fashion outfit ideas for 2024. I hope that you found this week's video useful and I hope it kind of gave you some outfit inspiration of all the things that should be in your closet for this season. If you like this week's video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and also don't forget to hit that subscribe button down there so that you do not miss out on all of my brand new content every single week. I love you guys all so much. Thank you so much for being here and for watching this week's video and I'll see you all next time. Bye you guys. Can you feel